Hey, it's Joe Glines from The Automator, and in today's video, I want to demonstrate this really cool script. It's called Multi-Rename Script. I think Magicinator or something like that was the original author of it. However, when we found it, it wasn't working, and he said, hey, here's the source code. Fix it, right? And so we did. Uh, Maceworth and I worked on it. We fixed it. Let's jump into here now. I'm only going to demonstrate a little bit of its functionality because it's an amazingly functional tool, um, but it's just way too much to cover in a video and I want to keep this nice and short. So from Explorer, I'm going to drag in my files I want to rename. Um, and now here, this is the, the, the braces N, that's for the file name, and the braces E is for your uh, extension mask. Uh, but let's say I wanted to, um, you put in here what I want to search and replace, right? So if I want to replace just, Let's say I want to replace just with, um, so just, and I want to replace just with, I don't know. I don't know. Let's do I, do, I don't know, right? So notice how it, it's showing you here. So it's going to change just an example underscore three to I don't know an example underscore three, right? So it's that easy. Or let's say I want to change for whatever reason it, uh, from a text extension. So dot, or we'll just do TXT. So it found the TXT. It got rid of it. Now it's adding I don't know here but let's make it an MP4, right? Not that we would do this because it would break, you know, it wouldn't work properly. Maybe I want to change it to a CSV, right? I want all those to be CSVs, right? So that would work just fine. Um, so it's a really amazingly powerful tool. If you want to do regular expressions with it, you can check this here. You can even increment. I've done it where I can say, let's let's add to each of these. Let's, let's set it um, to start at three instead of two and add to them. Um, it's, it's a really, really powerful tool. You can preview it to show what it's going to look like. So let's say, oh, let's do a little map. So this will show us how they're going to get named. Um, again, really powerful tool. So uh, I'll put the um, URL on the uh, download in, in the description, uh, but it'll basically be the dash automator.com slash MRS for multi renamed script. And I uh, hope you enjoy it. It's, it's an, uh, just be careful. There is an undo button. So let's, let's try it. So I'm going to change this to all CSVs. Hit start. You'll notice over here, they all get changed. Now, if I hit undo, let's see if it works. Undo what we just did, yes. Wow, that's fascinating. It did all but one. I wonder what's up with that. But um, you get the, let's see if we try undo again. Nope. So uh, interesting. So apparently a little bug, but um, you get the idea, right? I've never had a problem with it naming my scripts. That's the first time I've tried the undo button because Usually that preview one really lets you know what you're doing. So I hope you like it. Uh, cheers.